Today was an odd day. I had to get rid of something that's been keeping me up pondering. I already don't look at myself often with a mirror, but I have one in my room for everyone else. Unfortunately, I have broken mine and I just left it up there. The first thing that concerns me is that everyone does not like this broken mirror in my room. They walk in, they're like, oh, and they say, that's bad luck. <laughs> that's what I keep getting. And of course, there is a superstition that breaking a mirror brings seven years of bad luck. And after looking online, this does not just pertain to me, it pertains to the home I live in. Now, the second thing that concerned me was the desperation of explaining that this mirror was not broken due to anger. It almost felt like I was trying to convince myself, even though it really was just an accident. Now, this had me thinking more than the seven years of bad luck that I had just bestowed onto myself. I kept thinking why I thought it was just okay to like have this mirror in my home and to just move forward like it was just a regular day. I kept telling myself, it's not a big deal, like who cares? And uh, I, I kept looking into the mirror and maybe it's because I saw myself in that mirror. Like not, I know not quite literally, but in a sense of people are kind of like broken mirrors, I guess. I, I have finally seen my brokenness and I, I just didn't want to be thrown out. I wanted to be made of use again and that's why I think I kept this mirror even though it was falling apart and it really needed to be thrown out. I just, I, I couldn't do it for some reason. Today was an odd day because I was finally able to throw out the mirror and I felt really guilty about it. I felt really scared. And so I guess that's why I kind of made the video with this. I just felt really weird about it. But nothing happened after I threw it out. I wouldn't say I, I felt relieved, I just went about my day and enjoyed it. But now that it's later on and I came home to a room that had nothing that I could see of myself, I just I feel like I've disclosed a piece of who I truly am. And that piece may be broken, but unlike the mirror, I could be mended and made of use again. I think sometimes it's hard to feel that way. It's, it's hard to believe that there is redemption for yourself when you're broken and there's shards of you that are falling out everywhere and you're harming others and maybe you're harming yourself. It doesn't have to be that way and it doesn't stay that way. Just, I think, I think I'm happy that I had this weird situation with the mirror <laughs> because I don't know, I guess in a sense, I was forcing myself to go up against myself and it's never easy to do something like that. I feel that I could appreciate my reflection now.